Here with head softball coach Jen Stark after a big doubleheader sweep of CW Post in uh, non-conference action today at the United Softball Field. Coach, first game, let's talk about that first, a 6-5 victory um, in seven innings. Uh, overall thoughts on how the team performed? Uh, it was a great performance. We stuttered a little bit in the beginning and spotted them four, but uh, the team fought back the whole way. They made some really great plays on defense. We really settled in. We had uh, Carrie Tristanelli come in in relief work on the mound and she did a great job. She shut them down so we could get back on the board with our bats and got us right back in the game and stayed in the rest of the time for the win. All right, Coach, in uh, game two, uh, you guys down 1-0. You scored uh, the tying run and then went extra, extra innings to the eighth and uh, Sadie Redman with a big uh, RBI double to the left field line. Uh, talk a little bit about game two. Uh, it was a battle the whole way, a nice low scoring game. Both pitchers pitched really well. Lana did a great job on the mound, holding them off. Uh, I think she really only gave up like two or three hits. And then we just had a huge performance out of Sadie today. She was the one that scored on the pass ball to tie us up. And then um, when we got runners in scoring position with two outs, she came up and just crushed one down the line. It was perfect. All right, Coach, you improved to 17 and 13 overall. Congratulations on a pair of wins today. On to St. A's and Southern New Hampshire this weekend. Uh, thoughts on the Hawks and the Penmen? Uh, well, Southern New Hampshire is playing some really, really good softball. They also took a game from CW Post, so uh, they're doing really well. So first we have to play St. A's, who is also playing some pretty good softball. We just need to go game to game, make sure we win each one along the way right now. We're on the right path, and we just got to stick to it. All right, Coach, thanks, and uh, congrats.